What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum walkthrough. Okay, so we defeated Crasher Wake for our fifth badge, yes. I said it, fifth badge, and uh, now we have to take care of a little issue because there's a Team Galactic Goon right here, and uh, yeah, it was all because of Barry. Now, you, you go up right here with Crasher Wake, and uh, yeah, Barry thinks he's chopped over. So this Team Galactic uh, guy is right here, and then BOOM! Oh, damn. And there he is. He's like, oh, that was rough. You, what have you done? Oh, technically speaking, they left this package. There's a galactic bomb in there, and then poink. He messed up something in the Great Marsh. Holy crud, and he's running away. And this guy's like, wow, it's invaluable. Don't follow me either. Yeah, okay, so he's trying to get that bomb away. And uh, Barry, of course, doesn't want to follow the galactic goon. He wants to go to his quote-unquote master. So he's telling me to not let the galactic goon go or get away. So that is exactly what we're going to be doing here in this episode. We're going to actually try and get this guy to uh, tell us what's going on right here. Telling him us about pulverizing Pokemon and all that stuff. Do not follow him or anything. So I'm going to continue on following him like creeper that I am because uh, I guess that's what we are here in this game. And, uh, well, let's see. What else? What else? What else? Oh, there he is. Okay, so what's up, buddy? So we needed the energy for the Valley Wind Works and all that stuff. Scientific this, yada, yada, yada. The engineer, scientific mechanical things. And, uh, Homeboy is still running away. And, uh, hopefully a poke. Yeah, okay, no Pokemon has been hitting me. Yeah, we're going to be following him for, like, three more steps. Uh, apparently this is where the story gets a little more interesting. Um... This guy's like, the galactic bomb was took a big wall up and, uh, oh, okay. And this guy right here is like, oh, you're eavesdropping. I'm just thinking out loud. I'm getting tired of running away. You know what? I'm not going to waste my, I'm not going to, not, yeah, he's not going to waste his energy knocking, knocking me around. And would you look at that? Looker is right here and he's like wondering, what the hell? Why are you so worrisome? Why, we, we, why is there a bomb, an explosion, this, this, and that, and the Great Marsh and all that stuff? Furthermore, you're pursuing the guy with the funny haircut and all that stuff. And, uh, oh, crud. What did I miss? Seriously. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, he's running. Yeah, so I have to go run for that guy. And Looker, he's just trying to figure shit out right here. So I'm going to continue and follow uh, to follow the Team Galactic guy. And where the hell is he? Hmm. Where is he? Oh, there's Looker. And, uh, well, let's talk to him. Said that hotel interviewing people. If they see someone suspicious, go outside if you will. Find them. See if there's uh, anything unnoticed or anything like that. And as you can see, we're on Route 213 and in front of the Valor Lakefront. And there he is. He's like, why am I running away like this? New world, new boss, this, that, whatever. And, uh, yeah, he's thinking out loud right here. And he's already giving away the, the, the plot. And, uh, well, he's telling us that he doesn't want to battle us. So we still got to follow him and all that crud. And uh, there he is again. He's like, you know what? You're still on my tail. You know what? The lake is within my my uh, my sight, so I'm gonna KO you. All right, bring it, just bring it. This is all we wanted. So as you can see, we're gonna be battling the Team Galactic Gronk right here, and he's coming out with his only Pokemon, Krogonk, the uh, the Toad Pokemon that is poisonous and all that stuff. Alrighty, so here we go, sucker punching us like a little bitch. Are you serious? Holy crud! Okay. So that takes a lot of a guy at number two's uh, power, but this is a critical hit, and that is how you do it. That is how you destroy a Pokemon like that, and uh, well, that is how you defeat. <laughs> that is how you defeat them. And believe it or not, guys, this episode is very, very short. I know I could have done it in like two ep in one episode, but you know what? I wanted to make an extra episode like that. So after defeating the Team Galactic Goon. Um, ooh, hello, hello. My other girlfriend, Cynthia, is here telling me about the what's going on in the lake, Great Marsh, and all that stuff. And, of course, she's talking about the folklore of the islands, the Pokemon lakes that are around in Sinnoh. Now, there is one more thing. Oh, damn, she was about to talk to us. And, seriously, this guy right here? Bro, I'm talking to my girlfriend right now. Leave me alone. And, uh, yeah, out of control, yada, yada, yada. Fuck off, man. Okay, so I hate him. Anywho, she's telling us, is he your friend? No, he's not. He's more impatient. That's right. He's very impatient. Anywho, there is something that she wants to do for us or want to give us, and that is the Psyduck at Route 210. If you guys don't remember, those guys are blocking away. Now, she's going to give us a secret potion to actually heal those headaches that those Pokemon have. And, uh, yeah, that will enable us to go to Route 210 and uh, go to the next town. 
On top of that, she will actually give you something else, uh, because I believe you're gonna have to go to Celestic Town too, right? Yeah. I'm talking about the Mirage Pokemon and all that stuff too, so she'll see us later. Bye bye, girlfriend. Bye bye. I, I, I love you. I love you. Anywho, stay tuned, guys. This was it. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next episode. Happy Thanksgiving, guys.